Hi everybody, it's Anton from Web Promo. Today we'll speak how to use real-time reporting in Google Analytics account. Why do you need real-time reporting? It can, can be not very important toy. You are going to real-time, visit overview tab, and see how many people are on your website right now. It may be interesting information, you can even meditate with it, but at the same time, it's not very important. You can use it to understand uh, the really peaks of uh, interest uh, when you publish something in social networks or when you uh, send your newsletter, but it's not the main idea of these reports. The main idea is to check everything that your programmers did very, very fast. For example, you need to check uh, goal settings. Did you do everything correct or your setup them not in the right way. Let's see on the example of our website. We are going to our website with Promo Experts and visit, for example, our conference page, our online conference, and try to register to it. I'll go to, I'll put there my name, my email. Close this pop up. And press register. Done. We've got special thank you page. And this thank you page was set up before as goal. How we can check uh, does it perform correctly? Let's visit goals or conversions tab in real time reports. Here we are. We can see that uh, there are two persons on our website that reach to this goal. The same thing we can do with events. It's really very important thing because uh, through events we can check all button clicks, subscriptions, downloads, and so on. So the main purpose of real-time reporting is to check everything fast and to understand did your programmers do everything correct or not? Try to use this function and you will know more about your actions on your website, about real-time events, and also check everything that your programmers have already done. It was Anton from WebPromo. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and put like to this video. See you.